So with the song Hold On, uh, that one kind of came out of nowhere and ended up being one of the most important songs on the record. So I was like sitting at home, you know, watching 2020 unfold like everybody else. One night I was at the piano and just kind of, I mean, that riff came to me. I think I did an Instagram post about it and uh, my boy Matthias, who, you know, I go way back with, heard it. And he was like, let me jump on that. And I was like, man, I've been trying to do a song with him for a long time. So I think like an hour later, I had some drums on it and I put a scratch verse on it. Um, and I sent it to him. And then the next day he came back with that opening chorus and those uh, background vocals. If you feel like you're on your own, broken hearted, just know you're not alone. I was completely blown away and I was like, wow. So I got back on it and I was like, okay, and I gotta add some more stuff to the beat to do this, this vocal performance justice. So then I got on the horn with my man Ian McIntosh, who I work remotely with, especially during that time. Uh, we got on a Zoom and we started working on the track together. And then uh, I sent the track back to Matthias and he came up with the second half of the chorus. And I was like, oh my God. So the song just kind of kept going back and forth with each other. And uh, it just kept getting bigger and bigger as we were going. The song started kind of taking shape. Uh, so once he hit me with that other chorus, I was like, oh man, I had to have a buildup leading into that chorus because it was so powerful. And uh, so then I brought out an uh, older keyboard of mine that I'd really love the string sound on it. And then, uh, you know, Matt got into the studio and recorded some vocals. What ended up working was the vocals he recorded on, uh, from his iPhone ended up being the ones that we used on the final track because those just had so much passion and so much raw energy from the, I guess the inception of the song and the, and the energy that we were trying to capture, you know, it, it, it just, it had it all. So we ended up keeping those. And uh, we ended up, my first verse is the scratch vocal verse. Uh, we ended up keeping that as well. And so we sent it off to get mastered and you know, here we are, hold on. It, it really, it really just is like a kind of a time capsule or a, a chronicle of everything that was going on in 2020. Mm -hmm. A very surreal time to live through. Um, you know, a lot of us had never, you know, never seen or been a part of anything like that. So it was kind of crazy just to uh, experience that and live through it. So. I kind of wanted to, you know, capture that moment of everything that was happening during that time. And uh, I think we did that. So we went out and uh, with my man, Chris Mega, and we recently shot the video for it, which uh, came out amazing. Uh, you know, shout out to Chris Mega for capturing that aesthetic that we wanted. Uh, that, dude's, that dude's amazing, does amazing work. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And uh, here it is, hold on.